today. And uh, weather-wise, pretty warm. And as we yeah. head into the weekend, uh, it's going to start getting a little bit colder. It's going to get really cold heading into the weekend and even colder for next week. Yeah. You know, we're going to end this year on a cold note. We're going to bring in the new year with some Arctic air. And the transition is already taking a place across the area this evening. A little bit of light shower activity to the south and east of Kansas City. Places like Harrisonville, Butler, Clinton, Higginsville, Odessa along Interstate 70. Up to the north and east of Chillicothe. We'll be dealing with some light rain shower activity for this evening. Notice that's well to the south and east of Kansas City. Still can't rule out just a few quick showers here in the metro for this evening up until about midnight. Farther to the west on Interstate 70, if you are heading this way tonight or if you have loved ones coming in from, say, Hayes, Kansas, I checked some of the road conditions there in Hayes, Kansas, to the west on Interstate 70, starting to get snow covered in some areas. The heaviest snow, the accumulating snow, will stay to the west. Of our entire viewing area overnight. Just find where you have the purple. Follow the purple brick road, I guess. That's the winter weather advisory. We could see several inches of snow tonight into early tomorrow morning. And notice that is north and west of Kansas City. Though Maryville, St. Joe could see a few snowflakes mixing in with very light rain showers tonight and early tomorrow morning. I don't think the accumulations are going to be that significant. For the rest of the evening, 39 degrees, just a few showers. Grab that big coat before you head outdoors. It's going to get colder. 40 degrees current temperature, northerly winds at 8 miles an hour. So the first cold front is through Kansas City. The second big one, the Arctic one, comes in next week. 38 in St. Joe, 39 in Leavenworth, ahead of the cold front still hanging on to 55 degrees on a December day in Warrensburg. High temperatures tomorrow. Now we're behind the front, so the cold air has already swept through. We're left with highs tomorrow in the low 30s from Maryville to Cameron, 35 in Kansas City, 36 in Warrensburg. It's 55 there right now. And mid to upper 30 south of Kansas City, Warsaw possibly making it to 40 degrees. Very light rain showers being picked up by Future Scan right now. This is what the radar will look like throughout tonight up to 10 o'clock. There's a little bit of snow starting to mix into the west of Maryville. Again, accumulations will not be that significant. Starting off tomorrow morning, rain showers south of Kansas City near Sedalia and Clinton. We will have a clearing sky tomorrow. We'll start off cloudy. We'll end with some sunshine. That's 5 o'clock tomorrow. Afternoon. Starting off tomorrow morning, 31 cloudy, but mo uh, mainly dry here in Kansas City. Lunchtime, 33 degrees. The clouds starting to decrease, and by the end of the day, we'll see some sunshine. You're still going to need that big coat despite the sun, only making it to 35 degrees. The Chiefs game will also be dry, but this one's going to be cold even in the sunshine. Prepare for conditions in the 30s from kickoff through the fourth quarter. Arriving late Monday. This is the Arctic cold front that will be coming on through the area. It will last until at least Thursday. That means morning lows. I think we're going to see single digits out of this one for some. Teens and afternoon highs only in the 20s. Starting off 2015 with some very cold conditions and a lot of wind next Tuesday. Accompanying that Arctic front late Monday, early Tuesday morning, there could be a little bit of light snow. What has my eyes is next weekend following January 1st. So that's Next, next Friday, Saturday, that'd be the second and the third. There's a system over California, and that kicks out, interacts with the Arctic air. Depending on the track it takes, we could see accumulating snow. So that has my attention. We've had some warm Sundays at Arrowhead this season for football games. What yeah, you say? Really have. Tomorrow won't be one of them. No, it will not <laughs> be one this Sunday. It's going to be cold. Bundle up. All right. Thanks, Nick. Uh,